morning, Saints. Today is uh, Wednesday, November 1st, 2023. Happy birthday, All Saints. Ha excuse me. Happy All Saints Day. Now let's go to the birthdays. Happy birthday today to Nathan Chase, LaDrew Morrell, and Philip Whiteside. Today is the solemnity. The solemnity of all saints. The church recognizes many individual saints whom it has verified are in heaven. Many more souls have ascended to heaven, and today is the day we celebrate them. All saints in heaven, pray for us. Mm-hmm. On menu today in the Saints Cafe, chicken alfredo and boscos. That actually sounds so good mm -hmm. right now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, that's that. Hey, saints, tonight and tomorrow, Boba Love at 87th and Lackman is having a boba night for the canned food drive. 15% of all proceeds go to the canned food drive. Make sure to bring your student ID. See you there, Saints. I've actually never had boba tea. Is it good? It's very good. Very uh, cool. Saints soccer move on to the final four with a one to one to nothing Parker Lynn shutout of DeSoto. Nate Lebrovo scored the lone goal off of putback off Bobby. George, Bobby, uh, Bobby George's long throw. SCA 12 6 1. 12 6 1. 12 6 1. Cool. Saints will play at the semifinals Friday at Spring Hill at 4 o'clock against defending state champ Maze, Maze South. Maze. <laughs> Maze. Corn. Yeah. Don't mind us missing up all the names here. It's fine. Right? I, I just I never said these things before. Anyway, there will be a meeting for anyone interested in trying out for the bowling team today in room 220 at 310. Attention seniors, if you have committed to play a sport at a junior college or college level, please please participate in next Wednesday's signing ceremony. By this Friday, just stop by this Friday. Just stop by the student life office to sign up. The ceremony will be held on November 8th at 315 in the theater. Attention girls interested in playing Saints softball. Please let your parents know that a softball parent or player meeting will be held on Monday, November 6th at 6 o'clock p.m. The brief meeting will take place in the Learning Center or the library. Again, this meeting is both for softball players and your parents next Monday at 6. Can Food Drive is happening this week. Right so, clean out, so clean out your dad's pantry and bring cans in every day. You could also purchase one of the great of the great looking shirts. A portion of your purchase goes to CFD and you can wear it with your uniform, skirt or pants every day this week. Purchase your shirt in the in the spirit shop today for $15. But hurry, there's only a limited stock so buy now. Here's Carter and Isaac with an announcement. Good morning, Saints. The canned food drive is off to a great start for the seniors, but the rest of you, it's time to do some catching up. An anonymous donor is matching every dollar given by a dollar and 24 cents. We must take advantage of this. Ask your parents, ask your grandparents, your aunts and uncles. One in five children in the KC metro area only has enough money to eat one meal a day. It is our duty to give these less fortunate children the opportunity to live a food secure life. The number of people visiting food banks has increased by 60% in the last year. And SDA's canned food drive provides two thirds of the donations that Catholic Charities receives from schools. Hit the store, Saints. Thank you for your help, and we'll see you tomorrow. This Saturday, November 4th, Teens for Life is offering two opportunities for service hours. Opportunity number one. Come do service at St. Mary's Home for Mothers. This home provides life skills and a place to live for women with no else to turn to. We will meet at SCA at 7.45 a.m. Attend the first Saturday prayer, and then head to St. Mary's to work. We will return to SCA about 3 p.m. This will be about seven hours of service. You must sign up with Mrs. Loafman for this service in room 124 or by email. There are 20 spots available. Opportunity number two, also on this Saturday, come pray with us. Mass at 8.15 a.m. at Nativity Church and then 9 a.m. prayer at Planned Parenthood in Overland Park. This is two hours of service open to anyone who wants to participate. Come pray to protect the lives of the most vulnerable and change their hearts. Now or, it's time for the dad joke of the day. What did the snail on the turtle's back say? What did it say? We. Oh god. Keep going. Now for our, um, keep, oh, go up. Now for our countdown. There's only four more days of the canned food drive and 22 days till Thanksgiving. 
Thank you so much for watching the Halo Morning Show. We will be back with more for you tomorrow. I'm Michael. And I'm Karen. Signing off. And stay, remember, stay, stay classy, classy saints, and together, together we shine. shine.